Good morning, folks. This is AJ, and we are here on the first Sunday of the year. And I'm um, just wondering, like I said, I'm going to be working towards doing more vlogs and stuff so y'all can know, see the back end of everything that goes here in the media ministry. Let's go ahead and take a quick tour through the church. Actually, I'm here trying to set up the... Um, Actually, I already remoted in and took care of everything here on Pro Presenter. It reminds me, I need to install Worship Extreme on the other computer that I put in place at um, in our chapel. I um, had a leftover computer, so it's always good to use some products or PC parts that you might not need any more, but they could be repurposed for something else. So kind of like how I just redid my computer case. I have a case that's left over and I still have a AMD FX 8320. I am thinking about putting that in the chapel instead. I technically only need um, a power supply. But anyway, now that we got this, let's go ahead and head through the church and say hello to some people, shall we? Let's go. So normally I get here way early church is about got 45 minutes before people are here. So um, and it's communion Sunday. Uh, let's see. Let's see who else is here early. Pop in on people. So we got our superintendent here that handles everything. You say hello, Mr. Vet. Hello, how are you? All? <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and peek in on the men. We're gonna peek in on the kids and see what they're talking about. As the man the prophetic events that will come, they are captured by beloved B, and the question raised is, B of what? You gotta watch out for that guy right there. You gotta watch out for him. Why <laughs> All right, so let's see. Let's see what the women's ministry, well, women's Sunday school class is talking about. So this is our new members class here. So here's our new members. Let's head over to see where some other stuff is. Hello, hello. Good morning. Let me go this way so I'm not disturbing the women's Sunday school. But that's the chapel where we set up the other computer. I'm gonna install Worship Extreme and I need to come back and run a connection HDMI um, over Ethernet extender so we can connect to the TV in there so we can put scripture up there. So let's look at, I think we got another class up here. Let's see. So, I think either people are still <laughs> sleeping in, but oh well. Now that I've made my rounds around here, let me share with you kind of the thoughts of thinking about fixing some, I guess, some projects for the year. So, as I head over here to the multi purpose room, I've spoken about this a couple of times. This TV used to be connected over to the sanctuary so that you could actually see and hear everything but when they were doing some maintenance in here one of the wires got cut as you can see this conduit is the one that I actually added but it's still pushing everything SD and then you got to switch and do all these connections and stuff like that so what I want to do um, is come in here 
because that's where it actually connects. What I want to do is actually get somebody here who can fix the drywall because I'm not a drywall person. I'm going to cut a hole in here, run these cables behind the wall so no one can keep disconnecting them. And then looking at getting a, um, what is it, a digital TV RF modulator, which will actually send a digital HD signal over a regular coax cable to this TV and any other TVs that are in the church on coax. So that's one of the projects I'm looking to do outside of already talked about running the cable and stuff like that in the chapel. Um, also looking at, um, actually we found a bunch of speakers. Let's go past here real quick. Excuse me, excuse me. Actually, um, we found some speakers that were left over from when they actually built the new part of the sanctuary. So the idea is to probably put one of those in our security room so that they can hear the service as well. Um, so we got a, a lot of cool little projects that we're gonna be working on uh, throughout the year. Um, let alone, the main one is to put some new projectors in our sanctuary, because they're older. <laughs> so doing good doing good all right so let me get up here and then we'll get to let me mess with some people here before i go there so all right no one's up here yet so normally we're going to be starting a live stream in about 14 minutes so i got some time to spare so Let's get some music going on in here and we'll catch back when service starts. All right, so we just started live streaming. We got a full, full media booth today. Like I said, we got the great, we got the great Melvin right here. He likes to stay off camera because you know, he's famous. I can't, I only showed you the profile. I'm, I'm gonna charge, if I get on camera, you gotta pay. <laughs> we, 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 got, we got Taurus, you've seen him on a bunch of videos yeah. before. <laughs> All right, so we have started our live stream, which is current. And to think, the entire time I did that, I didn't have the record button. That was awesome. You didn't have <laughs> mm -mm. So I think I did this whole thing and didn't have record on. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so pretty much it's um, nine minutes before service. We already have the live stream going on. Um, we're using Vimeo and we're streaming to our website perfectly fine, but I forgot to turn on the multicast, which rebroadcast the Facebook. So as you can see, it's up there now and I just pinned it to the top of the page and we already got two people there. So we have music being played right now, which I got to be careful with the music that's playing in the background right now. Um, and actually the choir just came out. So we're probably going to start praise and worship here pretty soon. So. Let's go ahead and get started with service. I'm up here doing my rounds right now. We got people like this. We got we got Joe over here. <laughs> All right, so let's go over here and see. We're gonna visit other parts of the church here. Right All right, so we're gonna. Check in on the security people, make sure they're doing what they're supposed to do. Say hello, folks. Hello, Good morning. Folks. Happy New Year. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, AJ? Doing good, doing Happy good. New you, Happy New Year to y'all. <laughs> wow. All right, so the plan is to 
those speakers I was telling you about is to probably put one of them here so that these fine folks here can hear the service because there's no speaker in here. So that's the plan that we're looking to do sometime this year. So I can't show y'all all the cameras because that's going to be the secret. Y'all can't see all that. <laughs> So I make it a habit, even though, especially since we have so many people upstairs, um, to just make my rounds and see if there's any other issues that are going on from a technology standpoint. Now, we use Unify throughout the entire church. As you can see, there's, <laughs> if I can get it. That's one of our access points, and we have those throughout the entire church. So, Sometimes we have some kids and sometimes adults <laughs> watching stuff that they shouldn't. So we have to go through and strategically remove them from the Wi-Fi. <laughs> I do that. And then I just look to make sure anything else is going on around the church um, from a technology standpoint is straight. Sometimes on the other side of the building, they um, want to see the service over here. And like I was telling you before, it still works. I have to hook it up because they disconnect it every time. But that's what we do. We want to make sure that when we have other people, like we have our um, children's church, that they have everything that they need and things like that. And just make sure somebody didn't leave sound on because normally during the service, no one's really doing anything or using anything right now. So let's see. And I, obviously I'm not going to show kids. I'll blur them out, but this is like a children's church here. All right, and it looks like they're good. So let me make sure everything in the chapel is off. And then I'll be heading back over to the sanctuary. And we got a lot of people in there today. So we got in the booth, we got about five people. Um, so that's a good turnout. Um, normally sometimes we have one or two. So like right now, everything is off, so that's good. Um, people keep winding up the mics. Why do they do that? Um, and this stuff is all bent up here. So I'm gonna have to go redo that, um, later on. <sighs> all right. So let's head back. <laughs> I'm gonna go to back so I don't have to walk through the sanctuary. I'm gonna go back through the outside and go back upstairs into the booth. So just as a reminder that what we're working towards whether you work with me directly or get in um inspired by the videos here on my channel is our goal is to help a thousand churches start live streaming this year who have not been live streaming helping getting the word of god out to the masses have an additional thousand channels on youtube facebook whatever streaming the word of God. So if you're interested in doing that and you're saying I'm all game or if you just started live streaming, please go to the link below, put your information in there. So that way at the end of the year, we'll have a list of all the churches who are now doing that. So and I forgot it's cold. So let me hurry and get inside. All right, so we're ending service. Everything went through uneventful. I actually had an issue with our online giving that I had to contact um, our vendor about. It worked on our website, but it wasn't working on our phone. So I'm waiting to hear back from that. Um, got everything posted. Going to start doing post-production once I get back home in front of my computer. So um, we'll continue from there. Thank you all for chiming in. Um, and watching with today behind the scenes going on with the Antioch Media Ministry. So we got Taurus here. He can <laughs> we can be real. <laughs> so we'll be catching y'all in the next video. This is AJ. If you like this type of content, I appreciate a like. Consider subscribing and hit that bell. That way you get notified when we come out with other videos to help modernize your media ministry. Again, this is AJ. We'll see you on the next video. Later.